Electro trying to destroy our power grid. The Vulture raining death from above. Spider-Man egging them both on in the very heart of our city, brawling like children. Lethal children, pitching a tantrum of death and destruction. I'm often asked, why do menaces like this end up with awesome powers? Why not someone like you, Jonah? <laughs> well, I have considered trying to use advanced science to give me powers, only so I could protect you in a more hands-on way, of course. But after much reflection, I've decided against it. Because power corrupts. I'm a man of the people, and I want to stay one of the hard-working, ordinary people of New York. So I'll just help via my talk show, my publishing empire, and my vast personal fortune. No need to thank me. It's what a man of the people does. Okay. I need to get after Scorpion, but I haven't seen Aunt May face to face since the fire. Think I can afford a quick pit stop at Feast. Whew, that was actually a nice break. Thanks. I'll have arrested literally everyone in Rikers. Again. What is it with people trying to kill me while all wearing the same outfit? An island vacation. Rikers Island. The only way you guys could be less welcome is if you were collecting student loan payments. I think you guys have it bad. All that body armor is bruising my knuckles. Mercenaries a bad name. Stay clear. Well, they attack me, but of course, I'm the criminal here. My permanent record isn't looking too great right now. Didn't I put some of you guys away eight years ago? Man, I feel old! Nice thing about staying in the jumpsuits, you don't have to change clothes. Right over here, 
Till Miles gets back, the best thing we can do is keep everyone fed. Oh, Peter, it is so good to see you. How are you? Healthy? I'm good. How are you holding up, May? Good, but busy. Oh, let me go. <laughs> oh. oh, there. <coughs> I'm okay. Didn't you tell me something once about accepting that I'm human just like everyone else? You and Ben. <coughs> Masters at turning my own words against me. I am fine, Peter. Just a little rundown. Where's Miles? Could he help out? No, he is. He's off picking up medical supplies from the relief center. It's amazing how quickly we go through antibiotics. Okay. You stay off your feet for a bit. I'll organize the unloading and check in with Miles. Deal? Deal. Give me a chance to nurse my wounded Parker pride. Come on, Miles, answer. Don't make me worry about you and me. Bulldozer went through here. I can't turn back. Beast needs those antibiotics. You hear the sound his head made when the big guy hit him? Like a bug on a windshield. Splat. All because he made one stupid crack about Need the guy's suit. Him. Hacking app should work. Pets. Dude's got issues, man. Big ones. Time to move. Should be able to hop that wall. <coughs> Medical containers in that tent. Maybe this will be easy. You see the way he came through here? Continuing channel sweeping. Both of them are. But they're on our side. Gosh. Get over here. Iodine. But no antibiotics. I need to keep looking. All right, all right, all right. Supplies over there. Need to get past these guys. Believe me, I hate watching that somewhere. Turns my stuff here. Just give us the info and we'll stop it. Why are the super dudes so set on taking out these beliefs? I can't afford to get stuck. Something about Osborne. They want to show how weak he is, that he can't protect the city. <laughs> Sounds like a lot of drama. As long as they let us keep all the supplies we find, I don't care. Yeah, man. This stuff will be worth a fortune on the black market. Come on, let's keep digging through it. We shouldn't have burned down the bodega. Cable guys give up the super locations? Eventually, yeah. Now the big guy's taking the stations out all by himself. Due to walk the eight ball. It's that Russian bug, man. Makes him crazy. That's offensive. My grandma's Russian. Another supply tent. Oh, crossing fingers. Looks like you're gonna divvy up the kids. supplies. No antibiotics. Somewhere. Oh boy. Better not try to short us. Gotta avoid that sniper. Hey. Bro, relax. Well, you can see. Dude, chill, please. More supplies. Nobody's putting me back in the cell. Oh, come on, Crate, be the one. Moxicillin. Perfect. That is a very large man. I found the exploding bulldozer. Supply loops and schedules. Now! Gastazal! Gentlemen, 
I apologize. My associate is inelegant. He doesn't understand the fine art of persuasion. Stop! Oh. Oh. Did not need to see that. Ford is right past him. Get out of here. No hiding! 
Maybe if I get up there, I'll be fine. Can I find you? I can trust you! Yeah, that container! Yeah. That's my exit. opening. So let me know I have these. Get off me! Just give us the wallet! Give it us, man! Help! Hey, leave him alone! Big mistake, kid. You can't just push people around like that. Or what? Like this? Haha, <laughs> kids got guts. Hip squared. What the hell's he saying? You're not gonna be saying anything in a second. <laughs> oh! Whoa. You want a taste? Nah, I'm good, kid. I'm gonna work on my fight banner. Miles? Hey, I've been trying to reach you. You okay? Hey, so, uh, don't freak out, but, um, I gotta fill you in on some stuff. Incredible work, Miles. Stick close to Feast. If the convicts get desperate, they may try to raid the shelter. Way ahead of you. Anything else happens here, I'll let you know. Great. Thanks, Miles. Yuri, figured out Rhino's deal. He's attacking Oscorp's relief centers. Think I know which one he's hitting next. Reports of a possible earthquake and or demolition derby at the Harlem Center. Sounds like our boy. Headed there now. You holding up okay? Tired, but hanging in there. We'll get through this. Keep the faith. Time to take Rhino down. raise concerns about Sable agents abusing their authority. Let's find out. Are things any better? There's less people complaining. You know why? Because anyone who does disappears. You seen all these Sable bases popping up around town? I heard they're prison camps for anyone who steps out of line. I've heard those rumors as well. And while I initially thought it was fear-mongering, something I have absolutely no patience for, I have grown increasingly concerned. 
Why won't they let me in to inspect their base? What are they hiding? We still abide by the Constitution, folks. And that includes protection against unreasonable searches and seizures. And freedom of speech. So if you have concern, if you see abuses happening, call me. If the authorities won't listen, I will. And I will spread the word to our fellow New Yorkers. If these tyrants think they can silence me, let them try. No one puts a muzzle on J. Jonah Jameson. Someone your own size, Rhino. There is no one my size, folk. Or maybe we could just talk it out. Ah! Rhino, what's with the team up? I thought you were a loner. Ah! Means and ends, folk. All of right means and ends. So what's the end for these particular means? Freedom! True freedom! No more suit! No more rhino! Okay, Rhino. Let's wrap this up. Never send an eight-ton infant to do a man's job. Let's finish this. Oh, Scorps, love you, but you do know it's good to cut in, right? What were you gonna do if I didn't show him? Beg him to give up? Yes, that is exactly what I would have done. Ah, like an old married couple, you two. Rhino 
Thanos getting his super move. What did Octavius promise you, Scorpion? But Sargon has no tricks. He fights for profit. Untrue. I ripped Spider-Man's face off for free. The money's... Now, you know, I won't tell anybody. And leave your skull uncrushed? There is fun in that! Come here, Pouch! I will teach you to throw real punch! My jaw's already absorbed that particular lesson. Whoa. Thanks! Octavius will do if he finds out you failed. Didn't I hear you took a poetry class in the raft? Failed. Like a therapy thing? Yes, you freak show! <laughs> a little force together time might help you boys learn to play nice. All right, Yuri, that's four down. Just Octavius and Lee left. Something tells me they won't be as easy. They're only half our problem, though. Devil's Breath cases are getting worse, and Oscorp is being coy about an anti-serum. I'm worried they're seeing dollar signs in a seller's market. I'd expect nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leave Devil's Breath to me. One of my best people is on it. Pete, hey. I've been through the city, state, and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of Sable's men. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. spreading scurrilous rumors about me. I want to address the matter of the Scorpion right now. Yes, I paid for the procedure that empowered him. We desperately needed someone to bring down Spider-Man. It's not my fault the treatments drove him crazy. It's that ivory tower elite scientist who was so hungry that for my money, he didn't take proper precautions. No one believes in personal responsibility more than J. Jonah Jameson. In this, I can categorically say, I am lifeless. Okay, MJ, I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay, Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Need to get into the security room to unlock it. He'll never survive this. Next election, he'll get destroyed. Maybe. I've seen Osborne survive worse. He is a cockroach. An arrogant cockroach in a starch suit. Don't let us stop over here, you. They'll lock you up. Mayor Osborne really lives here? I never see him. Yeah. 
That elevator goes straight to his pen. There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. A health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. Hey, let us back upstairs. I've got a medical emergency here. Oh man, I can't breathe. Let me back upstairs. Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. Ugh. Every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs. That should do it. Oh, crap. Jerry, get out of here. We got a situation. Let us upstairs before we all catch the disease. Security room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. I know this is frustrating, but please remember, Sable is doing this for your safety. More like Osborne's safety. Please, everyone, please remain calm. Because you run a cops are incompetent. Alarms every other minute. And where's your stun gun? Hello. Man, I, I, I know a few tell. Sable agents who would love to meet you. I, I swear, I swear your way out of here. We're in charge. Okay, okay, I'm gone. <laughs> I like this thing. Sable offers workman's comp. Elevator controls in the security room next to the Sable agent. Mary Jane Watson, super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. That did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Fire it. Useless button. Hmm.
Zimmerman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm gonna find it. Warning. Fire doors engaged. Automated self-diagnostic commencing. Please remain calm. What is this thing? Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses. Whoa, this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. The Fabulous Osborne Boys. Norman bids his son farewell. Huh. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Norman so dramatic about a trip to Europe? Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. I need to find the code for that keypad. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. Work order for keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Self-diagnostic complete. No faults found. Fire doors disengaged. <sighs> Norman could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry's last day. I know he left last summer, but was it July or August? Harry kept a journal. Maybe he recorded the date there. This room smells like rich people. Wonder if all this wine is from Norman's vineyard in Burgundy. Harry said his mom used to cook all the time. I'd be surprised if Norman has ever even touched the stove. Norman locked up Harry's room, wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? City's in a state of emergency, but Norman still manages to get his laundry and cleaning done for him. <laughs> what a hero. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michaels for one last shot before the, um, the big trip. Um, uh, hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway, listen, I know I don't say this enough, but thank you, Dad, you know, for doing this. I love you. Wow. Haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. Look at all this. 
guess. Norman certainly likes to remind guests of his status. A photo was removed, though. Wonder what was there. and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. <laughs> Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in May's kitchen. Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Feels like there's something attached to the back of the frame. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. Norman's bathroom is bigger than my entire apartment. Now I feel sad. Ugh, Norman would have a pool. New York is about subway rats and street pizza, not sunbathing and umbrella drinks. Can't be for Harry, can it? Why didn't you tell us you were sick? Law books. Harry wants to be an environmental attorney. Like his mom. Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum is ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Control. Status. Nothing to report.
We're compromised. Okay, July 18. Bingo. Super creep. Gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Something in this room must be useful. What are these things? Prototype hand grenades? Norman Osborne, GR-27 research log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR-27 is a cure, not a disease. But try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath, and are using it to stoke hysteria. They have no idea what it's really capable of. A cure for cancer, genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little more research, I know we could perfect it. Instead, I'll spend the next 18 months on PR mop-up. What a waste of time. Devil's Breath isn't a disease. It's an attempt at a cure. I almost can't believe it. Harry and Emily's medical records. GR-27 was developed to treat them. Devil's Breath is a failed cure for Norman's own family. Got a real mad scientist thing going on. Wow, Norman wins the fancy map contest. Looks like the Upper West Side. Looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's properties. Had no idea they owned so much of New York. Sable troop deployments. They're stationed all over the city. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath Lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of Sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. And this must be the C team. Good old Alpha Team. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable present. Commercial building. Wow. 
So many Oscorps go- No. Norman's not crazy enough to keep the anti-serum in a shopping center. A records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil's Breath Lab. Should check the patrol routes against Oscorp buildings. Good ol' Alpha Team. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable presence. Should check the patrol routes against Oscorp buildings. Bet I'm looking for a heavily guarded Oscorp building that Dr. Michaels visits. Oscorp's going all in on defense research. Good ol' Alpha Team. Where do these three categories overlap? That must be the lab's location. Dr. Strom. Isn't he a robotics expert? No movement from Dr. Van Adder. Must Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Wherever the anti-serum is, he must have been too. No. A records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil's Breath lab. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big Sable presence. GR-27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that... I knew it. Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR-27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. created Lee. I, I have to get this. What? No! Who's there? Oh, no. a breach. High alert. Pete, I've got the lab location. And a lot more. How far away are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running.
need to clear that balcony. You're amazing. <laughs> it's all so much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. This is all my fault. No, not this song again. You are not alone anymore, Pete. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You... you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks. Partner. to get that anti-serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach Leonardo. Convince them to give up this crusade for revenge. They've both done so much good for the world. They can't throw their legacies away just to spite Norman. Okay, Norman's on his way to get the anti-serum. Better update Yuri. I hope this is good news. It is. Oscorp just created an anti-serum. There's a cure? Oh, thank God. How quickly can we get it to people? I'm on my way to find out. The lab is at 10th and Cathedral. Wait. I just got a report of a helicopter going down in that area. Oh no. That could be Norman's helicopter. I'd send officers your way, but I don't have any. Don't worry. I'm on it. This'll all be over soon. I promise. <laughs> 